10.24 BlackBerry 10 has not yet uh, been released. 10.1 is actually making its way around right now. But I want to show you a couple of neat features that are in the BlackBerry 10.2 beta that's going around town. I do have it installed on my Z10. And the first thing you're going to notice is on the left hand side, <clears throat> the icons are still there. Just like in, in the official release of BlackBerry 10. The difference is you can actually tap on one of those icons and see what is in that message. So you can preview what is being uh, contained in that message. So very neat if you don't actually don't want to open up the um, hub or open up the actual email app or whatever it be. You have access to what is inside those messages. The other neat thing, which I'm going to demo out to you here in one, is instant notifications. This is really cool because now you will be able to respond and view a message that um, you get, whether it's email or a text message or BPM, you'll have a quick display of it. So it's very, very cool to see um, BlackBerry add that feature. We'll display it here in just one moment. So traditionally, you'll get you know the normal BBM noise that you could possibly change it to, or um, see the flashing LED that is very famous. Now, with the BlackBerry 10.2, you will actually see on the screen an instant notification. And there it is. So now I can tap on that, and it will allow me to go into it, or hit the arrow, and I'll be able to text um, right into that message whether now once again like I said text message BPM or email all of them he'll be able to respond to so very very neat uh, feature that is added to 10.2 another thing that they uh, improved on a little bit was the calendar and nothing wrong with the initial calendar I don't think myself I like it I use it all the time as you can see on my screen here but we'll go ahead and add a new uh, calendar and spread it out into a different window so before it used to be everything was on the one screen so uh, the time people and all that kind of stuff was all in there now it is actually broken it up a little bit more so if you want to actually change the date and time you can hit on time and date there and you can adjust the start and date just like you would in the past but now it's in a separate window so it does add a little bit in that extra step if you think about it but it's still um, just makes it a better, neat, clear um, picture for you. So those are two new features that I found on BlackBerry 10.2 that I really, really enjoy. If you're willing to brave it, feel free to have at it.